my dudes, it's been a minute on the GPU content, but we got some good stuff coming for you. So I told you we'd be building that 3080 rig and here we go. She's looking beautiful. So we're gonna be taking you guys through this build using the Delta 2400 watt power supplies. Now that's a pair of them. It does not need that much juice, but we had a couple of them here. These are 240 power. So you got, these are not 110. You can see with the triple connectors here, we're gonna be taking you guys through this and our build related to this, different algorithms that we're gonna be mining. Ravencoin, we're talking Ethereum Classic. We're talking Ethereum. Flux, I'm gonna take you through the whole gambit on this and get the power measurements and heat and sound and all the fun stuff that comes along with it. And what's the output? So you could take this from a single GPU standpoint or you could take this from you know, a build out like this where we have quite a few GPUs here, a lot of 11 GPUs here on this particular build. Now there's obviously a handful of other things that we're gonna be testing and trying. We got a couple of rigs over there ready to go and some other ones and QZs that we still haven't covered yet with you guys. Some more deep dives on the 3090 Ti. It broke our meter, which sucks, but we're working on that to get a new meter that can actually handle the 3090, the 660 watts that it can pull if you go full tilt with it. Uh, the 3090 Ti, that is. And we'll go through kind of the gamut on the various setups that we have when it comes to the Ampere stuff. So I know you guys are missing some of the GPU content. There is an absolute metric ton of GPU content that we got going. We still haven't also forgot about the L7 there. It's been running. I've been doing kind of a longer two week test with that just to show the consistency of it and the payouts for folks that are still interested in some of the ASIC content. We got that L7 running there. So lots of content coming your way. Make sure you're liking and subscribing. We're also gonna have a noob series coming out for all you newbies out there when it comes to getting into the crypto space. And I'm taking it from a different perspective. I'm taking it from a perspective of if you had somebody that doesn't understand anything and when it comes to cryptocurrency in general, so we're talking wallets, trading, uh, mining, all the different aspects, and then just kind of lay it all out on a table, just saying, you know, here's crypto, here's what it does, here's the value propositions, here's proof of work, proof of stake. If you're gonna get into proof of work, here's various mining aspects that you can get into it from. You can do, uh, you know, a GPU, here's the CPU mining aspect of it, here's the FPGA aspect of it, here's the ASIC aspect of it. What are the costs there? How do you do the numbers? The very basics of the calculations and then make sure that you guys understand the nuance to all of the different things from your operations cost, power, how to calculate stuff, all the tools, all that. So. This was just talking to a couple of our folks that are working here at the service center and trying to understand you know, from their perspective and a young person's perspective especially, that's looking at crypto and how to get into it. So I wanna, we're gonna take that series like we did with BBT Ray a while back and walk you guys through from the beginning, just how, you know, a re, another resource on cryptocurrency stuff. We got several things with this that we're gonna be covering. We gotta get some pictures in here. Any of you artists out there, that have, you know, crypto art, hit me up, throw me a DM, and maybe we'll pick up a few pieces from you. I'm wanting to decorate this whole place with crypto art. And we have an opportunity too, where if you have prints and all that kind of stuff, you could put a QR code on it and we can maybe work something out where we get your print and we'll have a QR code on there. And so during the videos, people will see that and then they can scan it if they wanna get it in their place too. So. There's some opportunity there for you crypto artists that have prints and want to get some exposure. We have empty walls here that we could put some crypto art in. So I'm looking forward to that too. So lots of good content. Uh, you guys let, it, let us know what's priority for you. Um, you know, if there's a particular algorithm you want to know, if you want to know a particular miner, and if you're having issues with it, put it down in the description. We're going to start to go through an annotated outline of things that we think that you guys want to see. And we're going to try to make that content coming to you. So stay tuned and I'll catch you guys on the next one.